Good day everyone, this is Alvin again from the Philippines and welcome to my list of favorites for Miss Diva 2023, The Road to Miss Universe 2023. Welcome! So, I'm back after a very long time because I've been very busy at school and, you know, you have, I have already posted about that on my Instagram. And today, we will be talking about my top 10 favorites for Miss Diva 2023 where the winner will get to represent India at Miss Universe 2023 and will also be choosing the representative for Miss Supranational for 2024. I have reviewed all the 16 candidates and I haven't seen any leaderboards or who are the top favorites of Miss Diva. So all my basis for this ranking is more on a personal preference and based on everything that I've seen and read and watched on social media. Also, I have picked my top 10 and then I know I forgot to say something, but mm. anyway, let's just go on with it as of the moment. Oh, wait. The pageant is exactly one week from now. It's on August 27th and I'm super excited because of course India has been constant, constantly and consistently placing at Miss Universe. So I have a very strong favorite. So let's talk about it. Here are my top 10 and let's see if you agree with my list. Starting with my number 10. Nikita Arora. She's in the field of journalism and clinical psychology. I haven't seen much from her, but her photos and videos are very, very promising. If ever she doesn't make it this year, she's one of the ladies that I really wanted to give it a year or two for some more intense training and preparation and then come back because I really think that she has some potentials to do really well. For now, I still I can still see her making and breaking all the list of favorites, potentially going very far, but there are a lot of strong contenders this year. So if ever she win, if ever she wins this year, then good for her. But if she doesn't, she needs to come back. Number nine goes to Aruna Beniwal. She's 22 years old and a top 15 finalist of Feminine Miss India 2020. I think she's a super beauty. There's something about her features that's bordering sweet and angelic and I really, really love that. And it can really be worked out for her to really stand out. Also, I have seen her catwalk clip and it's okay, but it could be stronger with some more polishing and training and hopefully she could give us a more impactful and something that really gives us more of that energy. Number eight goes to Archana Bavsar. She's 21 years old and is into performing arts. I don't know why, but there's something about her that I really find captivating. I really love her strong facial features, especially if she's styled in a way that highlights her features. She could be a standout in terms of beauty, although I haven't heard her speak yet, so I don't know anything about her in terms of interview, but overall, I think the potential is there. Number seven. Ayushi Tiwari. She's 23 years old and a content writer. I do like her beauty. I think she's transformable. However, I'm not sure if this is her year yet. There could be some transformation that could happen in a few remaining days. But in terms of styling, I really hope that they will level it up even more. And we'll see. I'm just waiting to be surprised in the finals. Number six. Trisha Shetty. She's 22 years old and a psychology graduate. This one is also a pageant veteran. I do think that she has the charisma and the vibe when she's on stage. She also looked extremely stunning, but I would really love to see a huge level up in terms of styling because I felt like we haven't really reached that full potentials yet in terms of the aura she radiates. But nevertheless, I think she could be a potential spoiler and could be a strong contender in the top five. Number five, 
Zushobeni Tongoi. She's 25 years old, a singer and a top 15 finalist of Feminine Miss India 2020. I love her beauty. I think she's got a refreshing look and her being in the world of social media has definitely helped boost her confidence. She could really pull a just by looking at her and everything that I've seen on social media, I can really visualize her pulling that fairy tale princess looking vibes with the proper styling and especially with her kind of beauty. Also, if she could make her walk stronger and polish it even more, she could really go far in the finals. Number four, Shweta Sharda. She's 22 years old and she is a dancer, one of my personal favorites in terms of facial features and aura. Her facial structure is definitely one of the clear standouts this year. I love how strong it is and I have seen how and I've seen some amazing styling from her and many of those photos if not all impressed me. I think she looked incredible. Even the photos and the videos I've seen from her is on a different level as well because it's giving us a different vibe. So if she could deliver in terms of walk, interviews, and overall appeal in the finals, she could be the real game changer in the group. Number three goes to Aishwarya Dixit. She's 27 years old, a biochemistry student and a model, and I'm glad how she openly talks about breaking the stereotypical beauty queen in terms of height and age. Honestly, I like her very, very, very much. She's got a gorgeous smile, she looked really beautiful, and I have seen a clip of her catwalk performance and she was just spectacular. I mean, I love that. You have to go ahead and check on her profile and watch that video. That was so good. I really enjoyed it very, very much. The walk, the turn, and the energy were all executed perfectly. So I can see her going as far as top five and making surprises from there. My number two goes to Apurva Shavan. She's 25 years old and a top seven finalist of Feminine Miss India 2023 and top 10 finalists of Miss Diva 2018 and I think those are really, really incredible pageant resumes. She has a very special glow in her, especially when given the right styling. I have also watched a clip of her speaking and she's just amazing. I think it is safe to say that she is going to be one of the top contenders to be in the top 5 this year. But currently, my winner and my choice to represent India to go to Miss Universe 2023 is number one, Sanal Kokrija. 20, she's 26 years old and the first runner-up at Miss Diva 2021. She is the clear winner in this group, at least for me. Since the winner will go to Miss Universe 2023, I think she is the best choice of doing really well at the pageant. She's got one of the prettiest faces this year. And I mean not just a pretty face, but a wow kind of beauty. She speaks extremely well. And her latest catwalk video, which she just recently uploaded, was mind-blowing. It was clearly impressive and has improved compared to her 2021 performance. I think if she wins and goes to Miss Universe, a placement for India is 100% guaranteed. So that's it. This is my list of favorites for Miss Diva 2023 and I would love to know your favorites, whether you agree with my list or not, and see whether there are some girls that I have missed that should be included on the list. So don't forget to leave your comments below, don't forget to give a thumbs up and share the video as well, and most importantly, don't forget to subscribe because you'll be seeing more of these videos in the future. For now, thank you very much and have a wonderful day from the Philippines.